the following video is a recap of my portals tutorial along with the fabulous beasts event and the fun I had in Wildwood in Harry Potter Wizards Unite. The following video is a recap of, of a tutorial I made about Portos in Harry Potter Wizards Unite, the fabulous Beasts event, and lastly, the event taking place. The port keys work similar to how you hatch eggs in Pokemon Go, but the only difference is that once you finally succeed in unlocking that port key, you will be told to search for magic like you would when battling creatures and then you tap on the screen walk through the portal and then you collect the item and of course to unlock this port key you need keys silver and gold they work just like egg incubators do in Pokemon Go when it comes to hatching eggs as you will see here in this clip how it works soon I'll be leaving for Wildwood Fast forward to the future. And we finally arrived here in North Wildwood. And of course, stay tuned for some action. The from Wildwood encounter with the fabulous beasts was amazing. And of course, the other tasks I did while I was there in the game. I still had a blast casting more spells as I keep getting better and better at this game. Eventually... I will see what happens when you reach the highest level here in Harry Potter Wizards Unite. I wonder if it's similar to Pokemon Go, but of course only I'll know when I find out for myself.
currently going on in Harry Potter was tonight is a fabulous beasts event, which of course the markers would be purple, and you have to cast a certain number of spells to unlock the beasts. Once you have freed them, and you get enough information about them, you will be able to place their sticker in there like you would with all the other miscellaneous items in the game. Well, during the Harry Potter Wizards Unite Fabulous Beasts event, we met new creatures such as the Hippogriff and so much more. I had a blast doing this event while I was in Wildwood and hopefully I'll be able to do more events in future videos. Stay tuned, everyone.